Hey, what's going on guys and welcome back to some Minecraft school. As you can see today we are outside because today's a very special episode. We have got the pets show and tell just like you guys wanted. So, who do we have? We've got Gru with his pet. So Gru, tell us the name of your pet. He's my pet butler, his name is Jeff. Hello Jeff. Ooh. He's cool, he's cool. Uh, Jeff Kelly, looks a little up. bit freaky. <laughs> I, I think he's cool. I think he's really cool. He's a little bit cool. scary though. Can I come okay. out here so I can see? Yeah, yeah I want a closer look. look. Oh, he does look a little bit scary. He does, doesn't he? Okay, Ooh. little Kelly, you're coming up next. Maybe you should go back over so oh, I can sorry. talk to you about your pet. Okay, Hera Brian. I have a lot of pets, but this one is one of my favorites. It's my fire dragon named Leo. Leo, wow. you look so cool, but you look scary as well. Look at all these flames everywhere. Oh, ta ta. Oh, and little Kelly, who's who's your buddy? Who's this guy? Hello. Hello. My Happy name's dog. Donut. <laughs> yeah, so hey, this Donut. is my pet dog, Donut. Oh, you're so cool. Nice to I meet you. Know, I didn't know dogs could talk. This is really strange. Okay, well, basically, there's a story behind it. I made a wish to my magic leprechaun, and now I have a dog that can talk. That pretty much sums it up. And his name is Donut, and he picked his own name. Because he thought it was awesome. <laughs> Do you happen to like donuts? Oh, I love donuts. They're my favorite food they are. Oh, cool. <laughs> that makes sense then why you chose that name. That's really cool. Okay, so guys, today is uh, Pets Show and Tell, like I said. So now we've seen all the pets. It's time to see what they can do. So Gru, you're up. All right, so Gru, what can he do? Anything at all, try him out. Hmm, are you sure about that? I don't know, you shouldn't have said that. Okay, little pet butler. Jeff, Jeff is his name, isn't it? Okay, so Jeff, can you maybe change the weather? Yeah. Oh no, no, my hair is getting wet. Oh, please make it stop. This is crazy. My hair is going to go all curly. Oh, thanks so much, Jeff. Wow, Jeff, you really are good at that. That was super cool. Yeah. Hmm, I wonder what else you can do, Jeff. Uh, any ideas, little lizard? What should we ask him for? Do you know what? I forgot to eat my breakfast this morning, so I would love a sandwich. Jeff, can you make a sandwich? Can you, Jeff? Yeah. Whoa, Jeff, that was so fast. How did you do that? that and we've got a sandwich. Oh, it looks so tasty. Little Lizard's gonna be happy. Yeah. Here's your sandwich, Little Lizard, courtesy of Jeff the Butler. Oh, baby, this is gonna be delicious. Oh, look you at that. Enjoy it's that got now. bacon and cheese and lettuce. Okay, I'm gonna go over here. I'm happy now. <laughs> this is it my looks food for the day. Delicious. But I have one final test for Jeff. Now, Jeff. I've seen that you can do everything, I believe in you, but can you take down the biggest, baddest mob of all time, Mobzilla? Yeah. No. no. Yeah. Well, if you say so, Jeff. Okay, let's see it. Okay, that's the end for Gru and Jeff. That was pretty amazing. Jeff is such a super cool pet. Oh, I would love to have Jeff. I want my very own Jeff. He's Gru. probably like the best butler ever. I'm thinking about replacing Butler Dean with him. <laughs> really? Oh, no. Uh, well, Gru, that was amazing. Well done. Back in line. And uh, next up is going to be Kelly and Donut. Can you live up to Jeff, Donut? I think I'm going to be much better than Jeff. Oh, we'll see. Okay, you're up. 
Okay, now it's Donut's time to shine. But little Kelly, tell me a bit about your pet dog, Donut. Okay, well, Donut has loads of talents, but the main ones are, obviously, he is a dog that can speak. So that's like the coolest thing ever. That is really, really cool. I really like that bit. Yeah, it's awesome. And also, he has this really great nose, so he could probably sniff and find anything you ever ask him to once he has the scent for it, which is pretty cool. He's come on some adventures and been able to sniff out some things that were lost, which is awesome. That's cool, yeah. And then the last one is he's really, really good at digging. So he's really, really quick. So if you had something buried somewhere, he'd be able to dig it out really, really quick for you. Especially Ooh. if it's food. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I'd say so. Donut loves food. Yes, Donut I do. Sounds like he loves food. But Donut, are you ready to put all of these to the test? I'm so excited and I think I'm going to be the best. Okay, let's do it. First up, we've got to sniff things out. Okay, guys, you know the rules. You have to stay here and face the school. You're not allowed to watch myself and Little Lizard go and bury these items. You don't know what they are, but Donut has to try and sniff them out and tell us what they are. Okay? Okay, sounds good. No okay, problem at all. Okay, let's go, Little Lizard. I'm here, and I've got here my go. trusty shovel to bury the items. You bury that one and that one, and Ooh. I'll bury this one. Let's go. Bury them really, really far. Okay, guys, you're good to go, Donut. Little Kelly, you can help out, but you're not allowed to tell him where it is. But you're you're never gonna know. So I don't think I don't know Kelly where it has is. any chance of finding it. Only Donut has a chance. Okay, oh. off you go, Donut. Okay, I, little Kelly, I think you should follow me. Okay, okay, let's go. Okay, Kelly, just follow me. Okay. Um, I wonder where they would have hit it. I'm not too sure. Can you smell anything? Um, I'm getting a strong scent over this way, somewhere around here. Just okay. stay with me for a second. Okay, a second. is it getting stronger? Yeah. It's getting slightly stronger. Hold on, weaker again. Hold on, back up, back up. Ooh. Um, Must okay. be getting close. I, th I think I have it. I think it's right here, little Kelly. I'm just going to start digging away and then you follow me, okay? Okay, you go down. I don't think I'll follow you, but you see if it's down there. I don't want to get stuck in the hole because you're better at digging out than I would be. Have you found it? I have it. I have it. It's a wooden chair. Okay, now just dig yourself back out and we can see the wooden chair. It's such a random thing for them to hide. I was expecting food, but uh, the wooden chair is pretty, pretty cool, I guess. So do you want to put it down there so they know that we found it? Yeah, okay. I'll just show it here. Okay, perfect. Uh, so I guess we need to find the next thing. Okay, little Kelly, follow me. I'm gonna start looking for the next item. Okay, sounds like a plan. Uh, try and catch a scent. Okay, I, I think it's close by. I think it's really close by. Ooh, if they hit it close by, they're not trying that hard. Okay, little Kelly, I think I have it. I think I have it over here. Oh, okay, we'll start digging. Oh, is it deep? Oh, okay. Oh, I wonder what this one's gonna be. The chair was pretty random. Uh, I, ha I have it, I have it. It's a cake, it's a cake. Yo. Oh, that's more like it. I knew they'd hide food somewhere. That's cool. Can I Yo. eat it? Um, I don't think so because we have to show that you found it. So if you don't have it and you've eaten it, they won't know that you found it. Okay, okay. Okay, little Kelly. We're on to the last item, I think. You're doing really well, Donna. Oh, it's across the road, is it? Is that the scent you're picking up? Um, I think so, and I don't know whether it's this little piggy that I'm smelling or not. Mm, Hello, li little piggy. <laughs> I don't think... I don't know. He seems like... I don't think they'd hide him. It's a bit obvious. So, no, uh, no, no. It, it, it's, de it's definitely not. Hold on, hold on. Oh. It's getting okay. stronger. It's getting stronger. We're going in towards the forest. Okay, I think I got it, little Kelly. I think I got it. I'm gonna start digging. Oh, is it underneath the tree? Okay, start digging. Oh, I wonder if this one, what this one would be. There was food the last oh, time. Oh, yummy. It's a steak. I got a steak. Oh, awesome. Bring it back out. I have to be oh. able to eat this one now. 
No, you have to hold on to it. Maybe afterwards they'll let you eat it, but we need proof. Okay, so let's head back over to the class. Okay, let's go back to the guys and let's show them that I recovered all the three items. Yeah, you did Ooh. so good. Oh, hey guys. Hello. Hey, did you get them? Did you I have manage everything to get... I do. Oh, oh, all of them. There's the steak. Okay, there's the steak. Good job. There's the cake. The cake. That's I really had the good. cake. I forgot the last item, little Kelly, the chair. I left it back there. Oh, oh no, no okay. I didn't. No, oh, I didn't. Oh, he tricked, tricked you. Yeah. <laughs> he tricked you. Okay, good job. I That's told you I was better food. than Jeff. We got the chair, we got that, and we got the steak. And actually, I'm a little bit hungry. The steak Donna, is left over, some, so that's You can for have Donna. the steak if you want. Oh, that's for being such a good boy. Yummy, thank you. <laughs> no problem. Okay, now, you said that you're really good and really fast at digging holes. So we've got to put this to the test. You've got to dig the biggest hole that I've ever seen, and it's got to be pretty quick. Are you ready for that? Oh, I'm so excited about this one. I think I'm going to be brilliant at this. Okay, let's see it. Okay, time's up. We're gonna come over and check it out. It looks like a pretty big hole already. Oh my god, Let's look at all this see. dirt. Oh Whoa. wow! That Whoa. is a big hole, Donut. I you told you guys, donut. I told you I was good, guys. That was so good, well done. All right, time to get out of there. You have passed. Okay, so next up, we've got Herobrine. All right, hey, Brian, it's your turn. Now, I know everyone else has been pretty spectacular so far, so let's see what your big fiery dragon can do. Um, he just kind of burns everything? Oh, really? <laughs> so he can't do anything else but burn everything? I don't know if we're gonna allow that at the school. Uh, Headmaster Bones, what do you think? Can we, can we see what he does? Oh, no, sorry, you can't do that here. It's not safe. Oh, I thought so. We don't want oh, the school no. burning down. I That's think sad. Leo is really cool though. I really want to see what he can do. Leo he is, is really cool. He is pretty awesome. Looks, he looks so scary. Maybe, maybe we could visit Herobrine's house because I know he'd be allowed to do whatever he wants there. What do you think? I think that, that would be amazing. Be I think Herobrine's house would be so cool. Ooh, yeah, it might maybe. be a little bit scary, but I think it would be pretty awesome. Okay, well, if you guys in the comments want us to do that, then be sure to leave a like on the video and we will go and visit Herobrine's house and see all of his pets. That would be really cool. But a big thank you to Donut the Dog and Little Kelly and a big thank you to Gru and Butler Jeff. We had a lot of fun today in our first pet show and tell. If, if you guys enjoyed it, then be sure to let us know with a like on the video and we will be back next week with some more pet show and tell. I had a great time and if you want to check out Donut's channel, he has his very own YouTube channel with all of his own adventures and his adventures with little Kelly. It's a lot of fun. I'm kind of jealous of the adventures they go on. <laughs> yeah, they're super fun. They're amazing. Yeah. But if you want to check them out, guys, the link is in the description. Go say hi. And yeah, hope you enjoyed it. And we'll see you next time for some more. Bye, guys. Yeah.